Uh, what? Okay, now I'm spooked. Alright, well, I didn't know that was there. Hello, I don't know what direction to look. I, I don't know, I don't know, but hello. So weekly Eve, we have three Sonics, a Diddy, a Rosa. I need to find some way of entertaining myself. So this is the rematch from Winners. Yeah. Willie apparently taking out Pop-Tart 2-1 in Winners semis. Going back to Smashville for game one, okay. So this is the best of five now, I'm sure the players know, but I'll remind them after this game. Pop-Tart. I feel like Diddy is one of those characters we don't have a ton of high level representation of in the UK. I mean, there was K-Coons, but now he likes to just press up B and win. So he goes a Diddy a lot less. Actually nearly had a really scary early off stage position there from, from Pop-Tart and Willie. Questionable landing back on stage. Pop-Tart's kind of taken it to him. Doesn't want to take a second L. Oh wow, nice. I like the dancing blade mixed up into grab. Forward air. Okay, up air, up air. Look at the flick of the foot. I really like Pop-Tart's item game. Pop-Tart is a really good item game. Uh, consistent Item catches and Z drops. Good. Good option there, choosing the fair. And he's, he's winning out in a lot of these air to air approaches. It feels like Willy is trying to stay as grounded as he can. Maintain stage control. Pop Tart needed to recognize that forward air was going to cross up. Did his legs longer than a sword, man? That's just how this game works. Mm. Good smart roll forward there from Willy. So, so rarely are people ever really ready to, to catch the roll forward. I feel like you only ever really start uh, covering rolls forward until, like, when, you, when you've caught onto it as a habit over the course of the game. You know, Did he just monkey flip to the other side of the stage? Yes, he did. Oh, beautiful pivot grab there. Definitely read that roll and popped up. My voice is getting shot right now. Could use a drink, preferably something alcoholic, considering that Diddy's on the screen. Okay, to catch up. Oh, yeah, Pop Tart is just taking it to these landings, man. These landings from Willy, a lot of questionable monkey flips. But a very questionable, I'll be there. Down, mm, down tilt, down smash. I don't know, not at that percent. Not at that percent. So, just can I, can I just clarify? Uh, Willy, Willy and Mark Marie is also from Spain, yeah? So, Willy and Mark Marie are both from Spain. They're just from different regions in Spain. Just to be clear. Okay, monkey flip from the ledge. That one works out. But a lot of Diddy players do have a pretty old down tilt up smash there. Nice stuff from Willy. Um, yeah, a lot of a lot of Diddy's can develop a pretty bad habit to side me back onto stage. You see, any even the best Diddy's. That was actually really smart. I like that. That covered almost every option. In fact, what could he? Have, he could have like jumped there, I suppose. But like throwing the banana on shield and then monkey flipping. He had to hold shield to take the banana hit. If he rolled back, he probably could have done the kick to cover it. Rolled forward, the same thing. You know, bear from Willy. Okay, Pop Tart getting getting caught holding shield just a little bit too much here now. Oh, forward air on that risky monkey flip, going for an edge guard. Oh, up he's at the barrels. Oh, up he's at the barrels again, and he gets a grab. Oh, he's, oh, I thought he lost his jump there. Okay, Pop Tart really committing to a shield breaker there. I feel like he didn't really need that at this percent. Oh, monkey, yeah, monkey. <laughs> I nearly said monkey banana. Monkey banana back air. <laughs> okay, down to up smash. That's going to take it for Willy. It's a shame. I feel like Pop Tart was playing the matchup really well for a lot of it, but then just uh, overcommitted to a few questionable options. Guys, best of five. So, you know. I'm sure if we're going to go to game two or where Pop Tart's going to be looking at counter pick, what is he doing with his tongue? <laughs> There's an 18 plus stream, so you get away with it, boy, but I don't know what you were looking there. <laughs> Back to Smashville here. I can see Smashville for Pop Tart. Not so much for Willy. I mean, he won, so I, I guess I can't. I should be able to, but obviously, those, those fast horizontal kills, good platform pressure on a Smashville platform. 
Nice trump there from Popta. He's going to have to overreach the ledge. Amazing stall. No, no, it wasn't. It's was a terrible stall because he died. <laughs> I like the idea, but uh, yeah, we're absolutely crumbling under the pressure of that ledge trump there. Maybe they don't ledge trump in Spain. <laughs> Oh, and he goes for it. I like the idea there. I mean, he's he's down that much. Why not go for it, right? That definitely would have gotten the kill. That was a smart decision from Willie. Just didn't work out for him. That monkey flip, though, doing a lot of preemptive monkey flips out of hit stun. Fair from the ledge from Pop Tart. Yep, waits out the monkey flip. He was anticipating a cross up. It's, monkey flip's kind of like a dash attack. It's pretty. Ambiguous, you can never really be sure whether it will cross up or not. So I, I don't blame him for trying that dancing blade. I'm trying to end it all right there, though. Dancing stage with the Nair. Okay, forward air stage, yep. Makes perfect sense. Edge guard takes that game. I wouldn't be surprised to see an all Smashville set, considering these guys have both won one here in the set. Man's just, man's just chowing down on apples in his set. He's about to try and chow down on this tournament life of plastic pop tarts. Game three going to the town and city. Okay, I can also see this as a pretty yeah, even stage here between these two characters. Pelly is currently waiting in grand finals. So the winner of this is to fight Pelly. Good jab to Dancing Blade confirmed there from Pop Tart. Yep, covering the fair on the ledge, and wow, what a nice string. Gonna cover that monkey flip again. Not the best monkey flips here coming out from Willy, man. Not Willy. From Willy, comma, man. <laughs> Not. Okay, I like that. He threw the banana and then read his jump out of shield and met it with a fair. Like I say, popped out again, winning a lot of these air-to-air -air approaches. Over there. Okay, and Willie's been overreaching the ledge with these jetpack barrels as well, quite a lot. And popped has been covering that. It's a lot of a lot of B button from Willie, man. A lot of B button. But I think popped has kind of caught onto that. See, he he went to oh, let's go. I hate that move, but let's go button B. He recognized that the forward air would cross up his shield that time and instead went for a... I can't remember what he went for. He went to punish the cross up. Did, will he go too low? Okay, no he didn't. I really like that coverage there. Covering the standard get up with the Nair. And jump and attack really and then just turning around. Frame 6 dancing blade in that roll. Or grab or whatever you want really. Kind of makes you... Make, makes your opponent feel forced into a roll and then you can cover it pretty easily. Grab. Oh, Chuck's monster platform <laughs> came just in time for Pop Tart. Wee wee wee. Saving my man. I'm having to try and make it back to the ledge. Wow, what a juggle! Is he gonna go for it again? Okay, no. Another good aggressive fair from Willie. I did like that. Not sure why he threw the banana off stage there. I feel like, uh, from what I can see, Willie's Willie's Diddy stuff is really good. Like he clearly has a very good hand on his character and all their setups. Jab F Smash gonna take that game three. But fundamentally, he's making some very questionable decisions on a pretty consistent basis. And Pop Tart, like I say, is caught into that now. So we'll see where we go for game four. Could very possibly see a run back from last DBZ in grand finals here. The grand finals at Dap Blast 122, Plastic Pop Tart versus Pelly may very well be the grand finals here at Dap Monday Meltdown 105, but not if not if the, uh, the man from Spain can say anything about it. Here on Dreamland. Even Wispy's. Uh, Intently focusing this match. Not sure what the outcome is going to be quite yet. Look at the look on his face. Oh my god. Is that Plastic Pop Tart? He's from Spain? <laughs> I love this 
Willie off to a pretty good start here, getting some some B and B banana confirms. B and B usually meaning bread and butter, like to to kind of imply a very simplistic confirm, but when it comes to Diddy, it's just a banana and B button. That's that's your confirms. That's your B and Bs. Reach the high monkey flip yet again. Yep, taking his landings out yet again. A lot of questionable. It's, it's getting back on the ledge where I'm like, Willy, Willy's options are really iffy to me. And his landing to it. His neutral is actually quite good in his item game. I like the way that he's willing to... Uh, I don't know. I don't play Diddy because I don't hate people, but I don't know if that's a Fox or an extended dash dance, but he's doing some kind of little movement back and forth to keep it ridiculous. And paired with Diddy's really fast item toss, that makes... Um, that makes his effective range even scarier. And Diddy already throws items faster than something that goes fast. Something really fast. Okay, back air. Amazing pressure. I love the uh, the back air pressure there from Willy. Scores that stuff on Pop-Tart. But Pop-Tart, yet again, head to air read. Yep, the Dancing Blade, not quite. But Pop Tart looking for an edge guard. I like the way he positions himself there. I think he's waiting for Willy to, to up B back on stage a little bit earlier. And then hoping to up B Willy's barrels. And send him into a tech situation. Gets the fair on that uh, ledge option yet again. Pop Tart has gotten a large majority of his kills. Well, not, not kills, a large majority of his damage on Willy. On, at the ledge, I feel. It's a testament, not only, it is more, more so a testament to Pop-Tart's ability to ledge trap, I think, than anything. It is kind of an innate, innate trait of his character, if you will. Oh, the banana fell! Oh! That was nearly an SD. He's back. Pop-Tart is just going to edge guide him all day, and that's it. He can't recover far enough. Well done to Plastic Pop-Tart. Really nicely done in the advantage there. Takes that set 3-1 over Willy. Home to the night, but a good a good performance for him. Ranked uh, 13th in Spain, did pretty good. Third, I mean, it's a, a very small, relatively unstacked meltdown tonight. But a win on Pop Tart is nothing to sneeze at. Also beat K earlier in the winners bracket. So it's grand finals time. Like I say, we are indeed getting the run back of DBZ.